Why does it always take two takes with this heavy thing? Good evening, my fellow Linux MC peoples. Uh, today we have a new short video. Basically highlighting some visual changes, nothing special. I've basically taken the tack of make everything nice, simple, and rounded. So as you can see, we've got sort of a nice, simple background color, simple, everything simple. Keep it simple. More simplicity. Gotta love it. Um, I suck at making icons, hence these look all kind of funky. Um, but you can see I've finally kind of settled on a generic blue theme that I think is decent. You know, it's got it's light blue, dark blue accents, so that seems like it'll work pretty well. Um, trying to carry that theme over to the remote screens, as you can see. Uh, nothing really special. Um, basically, just slowly kind of figuring in, mass <coughs> excuse me, massing in all the spaces because this has to all kind of scale neatly. So I'm trying to figure out what fits where and all that good stuff. Um, show you the video remote screen. And these buttons haven't been implemented yet, but as you can see, I'm sticking with the theme: simple, nice round buttons, things of that nature. Um, essentially the same thing as you can see like when you mouse over something it shows up the text size needs to be increased but you know that's an, another aesthetic thing um, I'm trying to think is there anything else that's that's essentially most of the changes slight menus and things added like that uh, and then because we always do where the heck is my button? There it is. As you can see, Mark has got part of his implemented. So, you know, we've got our now playing image and stuff there. If I click on it, oh, he doesn't have the screen. Oh, no. Um, but there's that. See, and we've got different rooms and stuff like that. Oh, I wonder why the images aren't showing up. I don't know. It's probably something I did. I tend to hard color a lot of stuff, and he comes back in and fixes it. Um, but to give you, show you like the dynamicness, you'll notice the now playing button goes away completely when I change rooms because I'm in the bathroom. There's nothing in here. Yeah, when I go back to where I am, oh look, it returns. And this effect pretty much should be well. As you go through the Kumo, um, we have the variables there so you can easily just make it appear and disappear at will. Um, yes, everybody in my house has a name that starts with an L, except for my daughter. Anyways, wow, why is this all sticky? Make you go away, why don't you make, make the bad man stop? Alright, anyways, let's give you a quick demonstration of the other one see goes away you only have the relevant scenarios and whatnot for that room um, I'm still trying to figure out why the sleeping menu hates me though it, it really does it, it hates me anyways that be it folks oh uh, one last note um, HA designer is good for looking up crap when you're trying to figure out variables and um, just where stuff goes. So if you happen to jump into C++ or even QML and you're looking stuff up, HA designer is a good place to be. Um, and then I don't really, I think that's it. Oh, if you find my screens ugly, good. Hopefully that will motivate you to help contribute some graphics or things for elements like say, hey, use this for such and such or use that for such and such I'm open to that because <clears throat> at this point um, things have gotten way more complicated on the C side on the code side so it's really I'm, I'm finding I'm having less and less time to actually dedicate towards creating new UI elements and stuff like that anyways um, see you guys out there